Yes, Pradeepa Raman joining us live from Bangalore for more details on this big news break of this morning. Pradeepa, what more do we know about this one person who has been arrested? Well, in fact, till yesterday, the police has been quite tight-lipped about uh, this particular arrest. In fact, 20 employees have been questioned uh, from the school, as well as all the male staff members uh, who tantamount to at least about six of them have also been questioned independently, each of their photographs being taken taken to the victim. The victim's statement as well as her identification plays a crucial role in terms of determining the arrest. Though the CM has confirmed that one person has been arrest, arrested, the police has been quite uh, tight-lipped about it because they do not want to make any kind of mistakes about this especially because it is a lesson learned from the previous episode that happened just three months ago where they uh, nabbed the wrong culprit so they do not want to make uh, such kind of an error this time so they've been quite tight-lipped before confirming and reconfirming checking and uh, re-verifying all the facts so that is uh, on one side the chief uh, the uh, child welfare committee on the other hand has been questioning the victim taking statements from her as well as the family sources now tell us that it is one of the attenders who could have done this and uh, that the victim refers to this person as uncle so all these facts as well as circumstantial evidence in terms of uh, the CCTV footage everything has been examined right now before which the police will make the final announcement all today. right Pradipa, thanks very much for that update but remember the Education Commissioner of Bangalore has also slapped a violation notice on that school after key documents were found to be missing the school has been operating its nursery wing illegally